Hey there, welcome to Good Works Lawn and Power. Uh, 269-720-4107 is our phone number. GoodWorksTractors.com is our website. You can email us, GoodWorksTractors at gmail.com. Google us, Good Works Tractors, you'll find all the information you need. But uh, here's our current inventory as of March 26th, 2018. Our inventory does change on a regular basis. We've got quite a few tractors that are coming in right now um, and some that are going out and that kind of thing too. So um, best thing you can do is either subscribe to our channel here. We do post walk-arounds of our new inventory as we get it uh, or keep track on our website as we do post our coming soon listings and then update those as soon as they are in stock and ready. So uh, you'll see these tractors are arranged uh, in the back row there are going to be our larger frame tractors, the uh, 3 and 4 series. In the front row you're going to have your 1 and 2 series and then even an X7 series garden tractor on the far right there. Um, in the back row there they're going to be arranged also from highest horsepower to lowest horsepower there from left to right and essentially the same thing I think maybe with one minor exception in the front row too so go through here real quick and just give you a, a brief overview of each tractor uh, what they are and again visit goodworkstractors.com you can see all the details tons of pictures uh, a lot of video walk arounds there too so this tractor here is a 2008 John Deere 4720 it's e-hydro 58 horsepower has a self-leveling 400CX front end loader, model 485 backhoe. You'll see this tractor also has an additional rear hydraulic here. See that there? Beyond the power beyond. Let's leave that like that. Also, this is an air rise suspension seat, something that you don't see very often. Only 650 hours on this, maybe 652, something like that. So I've used this one a decent amount myself. Fun tractor to use. Here with the canopy, this is a 2015 John Deere 4044M. Right now I do have pallet forks on there, but it does come with a 72 inch bucket. This tractor has warranty until December of 2018. These rear tires are loaded with about 1,500 pounds of ballast weight. This loader will pick up approximately 2,300 pounds to full height. It is also e-hydro. Uh, you'll see this additional valve on the loader there for a grapple function and it's plumbed all the way to the front up here. So make my way around here. Next tractor here is going to be a 2007 John Deere 4105. Rear tires are loaded on this tractor as well. These are ag tires. They're a little bit skinnier. So they're not going to have quite as much fluid. You're about 1,350 pounds of ballast weight there. 300 CX quick attach front end loader. You'll notice this has an optional skid steer style quick, quick connect on there instead of the John Deere style. So that is a additional feature. Um, so anything that works for a skid steer, you'll be able to use here. Sorry, I apologize for the wind. You'll also see this tractor has a rear remote on it. So good for a third function there. Scoot on over here, take a look. This is a 2016 John Deere 3033R. Beautiful tractor, model H160 front end loader. It is quick parked, quick attached to the bucket on there. It's a three range e-hydro transmission. 72 inch drive over auto connect mower deck. Very nice tractor, about 460 hours on it. Four years of warranty left. 1,200 pounds of ballast weight in these rear tires. Oh, if I didn't mention it here, about 877 hours on this 4105. All right, sneaking over here. Next tractor up will be a 2011 John Deere 3320. Also e-hydro, three range transmission. Model 300X front end loader, it is quick attach. Bucket is also quick attach. About 590 hours here. Great feature here is it does have two rear remotes, the fourth and the fifth. Back end there. Suspension seat, very nice. This front row will be easier. Don't have to go 
in and around other tractors. Okay, we do have a John Deere 3032E here. I can't remember, it's either 2011 or 2013. Quick attach bucket on there, only 225 hours. This is 32 horsepower. I have to say thank you to my father-in-law. He's been doing a lot of the detail work for me lately. Did a great job on this tractor, cleaned up very nicely. Here's a 2003 790. It's a beautiful tractor, considering I it for myself, but I'm in the business of selling tractors. Equipped with a Quick Park Model 419 front end loader, along with a quick attach bucket, R4 tires. These are not loaded. This is gear drive. Only 211 hours now. My phone ran out of space, so I had to free some up, but uh, this is a 2003 John Deere 790. Uh, I think we already went over that, but it has 211 hours on it. One owner machine, beautiful shape, gear drive. Look at the paint on the floorboards there. Just hardly used over the last 15 years. It's a rare specimen indeed. All right, front row here. Over on the far end here, this is a 2014 Kubota B2620. The backhoe was added in 2017. Only 178 hours on this tractor, 26 horsepower. Kubota diesel engine, quick park front end loader on there. Hydrostatic. Next up, 2014 John Deere 2025R. 25 horsepower, Yanmar diesel, 62 inch drive over mower deck, H130 model, quick park front end loader with a quick attach bucket. 123 hours on this bad boy. All right, let's see which one we have here. This is a 2017 John Deere 1025R. 355 hours right around there. 60 inch auto connect drive over mower deck. H120 quick park. Front end loader with a quick attach bucket. You have almost five years of warranty left on here. These are awesome tractors, very popular. Okay, another 1025. This one is a 2014, about 640 hours on it. 60 inch drive over deck, auto connect as well. Same deal there on the loader, H120 quick park with the quick attach bucket. This one does come with that eye match on the back along with a, a brush hog and a box blade. Okay, this is a 2012 John Deere 1026R. About 650 hours on here. 54 inch auto connect mower deck. H120 quick park loader. Quick attach bucket as well. Lastly here, we do have a John Deere X744. Just got this in. Need to clean it up still, a little dirty. But it has um, gone through the uh, recent tune-up at the end of the season last year before it was traded in so it's it's ready to go it runs great uh, I do have a new shoe coming for it over here on the discharge right here we have a 2013 John Deere 997 31 horsepower diesel commercial mower with a 60 inch deck and a dump from the seat material collection system only 258 hours Just beautiful condition all around.